Wireless technologies are transforming the routine of daily life. The benefits of wireless communications include increased productivity, mobility and safety. This video will introduce you to what expert groups and government agencies know about the safety of wireless technologies, including answers to some of the most common questions. Devices such as mobile phones send and receive low-power radio signals. When making a call, signals are sent to a base station that connects the call to either the fixed line network or another base station. Base stations are placed in areas to obtain coverage and capacity. These radio signals are a form of electromagnetic energy and are part of our everyday environment. The sun is a major natural source of electromagnetic fields, while ordinary household appliances such as televisions and vacuum cleaners all generate their own fields. These fields form part of the electromagnetic spectrum known as non-ionizing energy. They are very different to the more powerful ionising fields, such as X-rays. Potential health effects of radio waves have been researched over many years. Based on that research, the International Commission on Non-Ionising Radiation Protection, or ICNIP, developed safety guidelines for radio waves. ICNIP's experts continually review the science to ensure public safety. Governments around the world have adopted ICNIP's recommendations. Those recommendations incorporate wide safety margins to protect consumers, workers and the general public. Manufacturers design and test their products to ensure they meet all relevant safety guidelines. The wireless industry supports ongoing research, often in partnership with national and international health agencies. The World Health Organization has said that we know more about non-ionizing fields than we do about most chemicals. Researchers publish their findings in peer-reviewed scientific journals, as well as report them at open scientific meetings. There are more than 1,500 papers on biological and health effects from RF exposure. No scientific or health agency has concluded that there is any risk associated with the electromagnetic fields from wireless devices. Research continues to strengthen the scientific basis for confidence in the safety of our products and address the gaps in knowledge identified by the World Health Organization. To summarize, it is important to remember some key safety facts. Mobile phones and base stations meet international safety standards that protect everyone. There is no confirmed evidence that exposure below the level of those limits poses any health risk. No scientific or health agency has concluded that there is any risk associated with the electromagnetic fields from wireless devices. The MMF has been working for many years to ensure that information regarding mobile communication safety is widely available and well understood. If you would like to learn more about electromagnetic fields, please visit the MMF's website. In the meantime, you can be confident in using and enjoying mobile communications and the substantial benefits that they provide. <laughs>